Hello everybody, I'm Tilly Douglas from Visual Sense Crafts and I wanted to show you today how to cast on with a stop knitting machine and it's so easy to do if you haven't got one of those bonnets that they use to hook over you can do it with a simple shower scrunchie so just get a scrunchie and just find the centre because they're, they're tied really tight these are as obviously they've got to be um, but if you find the rope in the middle and just snip that off and then pull it all apart you've got loads and loads and loads of netting quite a lot goes into one of these bath and scrunchy wash things and then all you have to do is find the end because you don't need to use all of that you just need to find the end and cut a little length of it off and then make sure all your latches are open so you can then hang your scrunchie over the top get that hooked up a bit well, I don't want it to be hooked up now oopsie so drop it down the middle and just all you do is just drop it over the top don't have to be very particular with it just hook it on so it's hooked on all the way around and then you thread your yarn and hold it down into the middle Let's pull it taut again. and then move it around so you can get to these latches here and then hook the rest of it over like that put a little bit of tension on it so pull it down a little bit at the bottom and then just crank it around by pulling on the bottom of that netting and eventually just keep going and if you've got any cut stitches which you don't seem to have so it's picked up really nicely so you just this is just your waist yarn that you just cast in on with and how quick and easy is that to cast on with and then you just get your weights on i've got some makeshift homemade weights which i'll show you how i've done those in another video and then clip your weights on underneath and then you're ready to go so there you're ready now to cast on with your sock yarn so i hope you found this video helpful and if you did then please click the thumbs up button give me a like and subscribe to my channel and click the little bell notification because then i'm going to bring out more videos and i will show you how i get on with my sock knitting machine because this is the sock knitting machine that i bought um, and it was in a terrible state and i cleaned it all up and put it all back together got it working again and now i'm in the process of learning how to make fab socks so hopefully i'll see you in the next video Bye for now.